my lovely people hope you're all doing well i am doing well it's another beautiful day another beautiful day it's a bit cloudy today here but we are good i want to talk to mothers today i want to talk to mothers especially single mothers i want to talk to you at all mothers in general not only single mothers but especially single i know some of the single mothers are have gone through a lot i know they have gone through a lot raising their children alone you know it is not easy and i get you i understand you very well and i understand your position but i want to add something into your life apart from the work the hard work the everything that you are doing yourself i want you to include prayer in your routine especially praying for your children you know at this season the devil is targeting the young people you know when the devil wants to destroy a nation when the devil wants to destroy a family hmm, they look at somebody they start as young as possible sorry for the noise there are people maybe singing and everything there because they are tourists they start to attack somebody as young as possible you know so if you are a mother you already have a child or you are pregnant i will urge you and plead with you please pray start praying for that child start praying for for that child counsel every plans and plots of the enemy every programmings of the demonic world that have been programmed to attack that child before he was he or she is born counsel them in the name of jesus rebuke renounce and denounce every activities of the demonic world but to harm your child in any way protect your child decree and declare life prosperity health wealth into your child all the time before your child goes to school lay lay your hands on their head and pray for them you don't know what the the kind of teacher that is in that classroom you don't know the other students how they are mothers i plead you pray for your children if you have not been praying for your children or you have not been you have just been praying uh, lightly or you are not being serious i urge you not to be very serious increase and intensify that prayer you will thank me i tell you the truth you will thank me the lord says you should play, pray especially in the night please stop uh, staying in social media for maybe 10 the whole night it's not nice it's no good honestly my 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 fellow mothers it's no good minimize your social media uh, time and uh, as, um, uh, put aside time for prayer put aside time to pray for your children when your children are asleep in the middle of the night go into their rooms lay your hands on their heads counsel every activities and every programmings of the enemy while they are asleep Huh? decree and declare everything good upon your children the devil is very cunning he can even use a teacher he can even use a student he can even use a, a friend when your children are going out to play before they go out of that door of your home pray for them this may may sound simple or may sound maybe i sounds but it is not stupidity my fellow mothers pray for your children i urge you please especially this month october november december please pray for your children please i beg you pray for them be serious about prayer pray for them please it is not a joke anywhere you go everywhere you go if avoid sleepovers If your children go for sleepovers make sure that person is a Christian believes in God believes in the Lord Jesus Christ and prays Don't just let your children go to sleepovers my my fellow mothers Don't 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 The night is a uh, the night is full of mysteries especially for the demonic world I'm not saying you completely not go for sleepovers. You can go for sleepovers, but do your research before your child goes, for, even you yourself, before you go for sleepovers. This is not a time to take things lightly. You have to take things very seriously. 
And also teach your children to pray also. You have to teach them. Because when they see you doing it, they will, they will do it for their children when they grow up, when they're adults. And the cycle continues. Maybe your, our fathers or our mothers or your father or your mother was not so, 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 so consistent with prayer. Maybe they were like prayer, prayer, prayer people. Hmm? But you have to go deep in prayer, especially in the night. As a mother, go into your room, close that door and fight the enemy. Decree and declare, no enemy will touch my child in the name of Jesus. I cancel everything. That the enemy has programmed in your child or on my child. So my people, I hope my message has been delivered. Please like, subscribe and share. Please like the videos guys. Don't just watch. These videos are important. They will teach you your children, children, children. Please like so that the videos can go to so many people. Thank you.